is here at Home and Homesteader at the PC Eden Homestead down here in RV. Now, I don't know about you, you ever been in one of them RVs and they got those fancy, can't get them open cabinets, the drawers and all that stuff. They're designed to stay closed when you're traveling. Well, since Homer's RV is stationary, it's up on wheel black like a real hillbilly get a stander. Hillbilly stead a gander. I'll get that word right someday. And I made it up. Can't even get it right. Anyway, a lot of times, folks, when you're sitting still in your RV living in it, these are meant for traveling. You might find you don't want those to be staying stationary like that. So Homer decided he'd like to have his open nice and smooth since there ain't no plan to be hauling this thing around the U.S. of A. or any other country. Especially not if it didn't have a boat to get it to a different continent other than the North or South America. Anyway, so as they're set up, these ones you got to pull out and then they'll open up. They got this little catch that when you pull the knob out it releases that catch well one things I thought is you could take this off then you'd have to redo all your pulls I think they're called I call them knobs but I had another homerific idea was the catch on the side of the cabinet that they go into is I could keep that in place but I'm just going to take it and flip it over so it doesn't line up anymore. Now, uh, since I had a couple of these different cabinets, I decided to turn them all up. So when I ever decided to sell this RV, I could know how to put them all back. So I'm just taking the electric drill. Could have just as easily used a regular drill. But on the top one... I'm just on the top screw, just loosened it a little bit. I figured this out because they're in there pretty tight. And the bottom screw, I'm taking that all the way out. Then I simply flip it up. And I'm going to put that top, that screw that was the bottom up here on the top. Maybe, don't forget to turn your drill back on drive from pull. If you line it up with your screwdriver, it won't make all that racket. Skipping around, just like that. So all I did was flip that catch over, and now the cabinet will close. But I don't got to pull on the knob necessarily to open it. Very easy, a quick fix. Did all the cabinets in the kitchen and up here in the top, the crow's nest to this fifth wheel, probably in less than 20 minutes, and that was figuring out how to do it. You can do it too. A screwdriver or drill motor with a screwdriver bit and a little bit of time, and you got your cabinets open up. Now, I wouldn't suggest traveling this way. You won't have all your stuff left in the cabinets and they'll be flapping around like my lips in the breeze. Hope you have a wonderful day, whatever it is you do, wherever it is you go. Find some peace and joy. Don't forget there's always new happiness and new freedom as you go through life. It is quite a wonderful journey. Enjoy the journey. Don't forget to like our content. Leave us a couple comments about things you'd like to learn about or see out of here on the homestead. We'll see if we can accommodate you. Uh, keep learning as you go. Like our content. Hit the bell if you want to be notified when we put new content out here. Don't forget to subscribe. Share with your friends and family. They might like our antics and adventure too. Hope you've enjoyed this update on the RV. And just saw you like update on property.